Hi and welcome to another Vengeance Producer Suite Avenger product video. Uh, I would like to show you how to make uh, drums with your oscillators. I do not mean sample drums, I mean real drums designed with synthesis here. So well, let's start by choosing a sine wave. Let's deactivate the effects. Since uh, Avenger has so many modulation sources and really quick and fast envelopes, you can design your drums here quite cool. So I personally like to use the mod envelope for the pitch for the bass drum here. And so you can hear I routed it on transpose, but the transpose only goes 48 steps in each direction. That's not enough, so we have another modulation target. The pitch full range has a lot, a lot more. It uh, has a quite big range. So. Let's go to the pitch and set the key track to zero. Tune the kick a bit deeper. So, yeah. You can add more points here. And this is the depth of your pitch. Let's add an equalizer, for example, to shape the kick a bit more in the punch area here and treble. You can even attenuate the spike here. Let's add a bit release here. So yeah, this is quite cool for a quick kick. Um, of course you can do anything here. Yeah, we could, for example, add another mod envelope and route this to the noise volume. And make a hi-hat on, onto the kick. So yeah, this would be a kick. Um, of course, you now could go to your key zone and say, yeah, let's do the kick only on the C note. Now you have your kick on your note C. Now you can open up another oscillator and this one can play on the note D. And this could be, for example, a clap. Um, let's choose a noise here, or let's keep the sine wave um, and remove it, but add the noise here. This noise can be shaped with the inner ring, uh, with, uh, you can set the noise color here. So now we need a modulation envelope for the volume. So I routed here this mod envelope to the noise volume. And as we all know, a clap has multiple attacks here. So that's a quick, well, let's shape the volume here a bit more. What you else could add now is a bit of distortion here. Let's remove it on the kick. So.
What you else could add is a bit of reverb. Let's choose a small room. So I think you got the point. Same with hi-hats, with uh, percussions, with claps, uh, sorry, with uh, hi-hats, snares, toms, and so on. And uh, I already made some kits here. For example, the dance kit. You see in the key zone, I have mapped them that you can play them general MIDI like like a drum kit we also have the hi-hats here are made with FM modulation that's why they sound so cool and metallic. Let me show you the clap here. This is the clap of this kit. And there's a house kit. You see there are just three kits at the moment. I'm currently designing those kits for the factory library. Okay, I hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next video. Bye.